Hello everybody, welcome back to another video on my channel where I'm documenting the build of the camper you see behind me as well as the truck that it sits on. Uh, it's been a little while since I've posted anything, I apologize for that. I have been working a ton, gotta pay the bills, and build the project kitty. A fair bit has changed since my last video. I also took a month and a half road trip in the truck. Interior has come along. It's fully functional. Um, I hesitate to say that it is complete because I don't know that any of my projects are ever necessarily complete. I will have a interior tour video coming up. Uh, you might be able to see behind me I, I, put, I built some custom aluminum crossbars on top of the camper and then I built a steel rack to put on the cab and some composite feet that that mounts to that um, mount it to the cab roof and those are done in a way that require no fasteners they're formed to the top of the roof so that they can just be bedded in caulking and that is essentially what holds the rack on a bit of an experiment uh, i've never actually seen it done but i am optimistic about it i know that some racks will use suction cups and that's kind of where i got the inspiration for it um, so we'll see see how that goes. So this video is going to have some metalwork and some fabrication of those. And then I'll get back into the other stuff in future videos. Um, thank you guys for watching. It's really cool to check in and see that people are subscribing. And we're up to, I think we're over 2,500 subscribers. That's awesome. Um, I started this just to kind of see how it would go. I enjoy filming projects and editing videos, so if people like them um, and it works, then it works and I'll keep doing it. Uh, so if you're new here, if you like what you see, please hit subscribe, hit the little notification bell. That way when I post a video, it'll pop up in your feed. Um, like, comment, all that stuff. It's really cool to hear what people think about it and to get people's feedback. So obviously things are pretty torn apart at the moment. Uh, I have a ton of suspension components ordered. Uh, I'm doing all new suspension with a little lift. Um, pretty much full replacement of the front end components. The truck's got 260,000 miles on it. So everything's pretty tired. Uh, it runs like a top but uh, just I, I kind of want to go through everything front to back top to bottom over time so that's what I'm in the middle of right now uh, I'm replacing the leaf springs and then I'll get started on the front end once those are done uh, I got wheels in boxes there and tires will be coming soon and still a bunch more I want to do to this thing it's a lot I want to refine I want to build a, a box for the top of the camper. Uh, I want to improve the bike storage. Uh, I need to build some ski storage. Uh, I want to get a wood stove on the inside for winter. The front end of the truck is pretty rough. It'd be cool to clean that up over time. I hesitate to say this. I went through that entire road trip with only my brights and that was an electrical issue. There's a connector that shorted and I know what I need to do, but it's going to be a little time consuming and frustrating because I got to chase wires and see where the short happened. Um, but I think I only got brights flashed at me maybe once or twice because it's a 98 Tacoma and the brights aren't bright anyways. So lots happening, lots to happen in the future. Uh, I got plenty of other projects that I will probably end up featuring on this channel. Um, similar to this, some similar, some dissimilar, uh, but I just like projects. I like building stuff. I like fixing things. Um, I like building things that I'm going to use, building them in a way that I like that works for me. I like nerding out on the details as you guys have probably seen in my other videos. If you are new, go back. Um, I have, I've documented every step of the process up to this point, uh, from the very beginning, uh, I built the whole thing from scratch. So, Enjoy the video.